official diagnosis was December 2016. Prior to that, we went through probably six to eight months of tests. So from day one, we got diagnosed. I thought, right, the problem is MED. There's not a lot out there to help people with MED. So I'll go and try and find a solution. Motoneurine disease is a devastating diagnosis to receive. Typically, somebody will die within two to three years of having their first symptoms. We know that MND arises in different people for different reasons, so it's not one disease in the sense it has one cause. So we're dealing with a complexity at every level, including the kind of treatment we need is going to be complex too. We will leave no stone unturned to find out what the best research is that's going to make the biggest difference in the quickest time for patients. That's so important to us. Perhaps the greatest uh, impact of Doddy and his foundation is the sense of controlled urgency and the idea of adopting new and radical and sometimes disruptive ways to getting the job done. Breaking down MND into its subtypes is enabling us to target therapies specifically and some of the genetic therapy trials that have happened recently. We haven't got the final results yet, but the phase two results look really, really encouraging. We now understand something about the genetics of the disease, why people get it. We understand some of the pathways that are involved. And actually this is now converging into some really solid information which allows you to take drugs and target the right pathways. We're now at a tipping point where we can bring together all these new exciting potential medicines and new ways of doing trials. Research is extremely expensive. So having the support of a foundation like the My Name's Doddy Foundation is crucial because it means that we have the money and therefore the flexibility and the speed to really respond to new scientific challenges and to getting staff when we want to do a clinical trial very rapidly. We may not develop a, an overnight cure, but I think step by step we will be able to slow down the progression of the disease and give patients um, a much greater quality of life and life expectancy. MND is not incurable, it's just underfunded. So if we can put the right funding with the right people, and we know who those people are, and we know that they've got pipeline projects coming through, if we can invest in those, we can make a real difference. I would just like to take this opportunity to thank, for, thank you for your support and generosity. It's been amazing. It's allowed the foundation to fund major trials, and not only that, allowed us to find people with them and you who need our help. We need to keep going till we find a cure and get rid of MD. But today, thank you. Take care. Love to all.